Hi, this is Paul at Keen Health. You know, being proactive with our health, having abundant health, really ought to be a no-brainer. We should be proactive because we know exactly what we're supposed to be doing. We know what the rules are. We examine the research. We've been doing this for years and years. How many thousands of books on diet are there going to be before we finally get the picture? Today's research tells us we don't eat trans fats. We eat whole foods, organic if possible. We take charge of our health by avoiding the junk food and eating right. We are what we eat. We hear this time and time again. They used to say this back years and years and years ago. What you put into your body is going to determine the results, how healthy your body is going to be. But you know what? We know that. We know that we should take a look at our nutrition. This is where it is. Let's view nutrition as medicine, like it should be. The things that build our bodies, that give us the good mind, that keep us stable with our emotions, that keep our blood level sugars nice and even so they don't spike up and down, so that we don't depend on taking caffeine by the gallons each day. By we don't depend on eating sugar to get up to feeling good, doing the pastry route, doing all this, feeling frazzled at the end never getting the sleep that we need, never getting the relaxation we need, and not getting the exercise that we need. So, we know, number one, take a look at nutrition. Number two, take a look at exercise. If we don't move it, we're going to lose it. We have to exercise, and we have to relax, we have to have sleep, we have to use relaxation therapy if we're really going to be in good health so that we're ready to take charge of our life, to get the things that we want out of life, to enjoy life, so we don't wake up sluggish each morning and it's a hassle to make it through the day. We have to handle the stress, and we do this through relaxation, getting our sunshine, getting our sleep, good sleep, and not depending on all the stimulants and meds that keep us going, but also we pay a toll in the end. Okay, what's the next thing? We need to take care of our higher self, our higher good, our spiritual self. We have to have that. What is our purpose here in life? If we don't have a purpose, obviously we're going to be missing a leg on that perfect abundant health. Okay, so we know what to do. No-brainer, right? No, it's not a no-brainer. Why? Well, because things get in the way. Stress gets in the way. All these things get in the way. The platter of donuts, the box of donuts each morning in the coffee room, they even get in the way. So what do we do? Well, to take charge of our health, again, be proactive. Yes, it's a no-brainer, but start with easy steps. Let's like start, like I know I had to, I had to give up wheat. I found out I'm allergic to wheat and gluten. No wonder I felt so terrible every morning. No wonder my eyes were all baggy and swollen. No wonder my ankles were swollen. No wonder I just didn't feel good. So, wheat. I eliminated wheat. It put me on the right step, and then it was easy to eliminate other things, to just see, do I have allergies to other things? Maybe I'm allergic to eggs. Maybe I'm allergic to dairy. Maybe I'm allergic to peanuts. As it turned out, yeah, I am. I'm allergic to peanuts, and I'm allergic to wheat. Everything else seems to be okay. So, we take little steps, we get in charge, we get in control of our health. Once we start feeling good, we start feeling vibrant, once we start moving, once we start exercising, and we start getting into that whole picture of what it feels like to finally be healthy, to not wake up with your brain in like a fog, to where you can't think, to where you can't react. So, yeah, maybe it's not a no-brainer, but you know what? We have all the information we need, so let's start by taking the little steps, starting with the food we eat, maybe what we don't eat. We know we can't eat refined sugar. It's poison, and it's poison to our body. You wouldn't think of putting sugar in your gas tank. You want to keep your car, your automobiles running nicely. Well, we owe it to do our bodies the same good. Let's keep check of it. You know what? And let's don't beat ourselves up. Let's use the tools, tools that are going to keep us healthy and make this really an easier job. It doesn't have to be difficult. 
we can do that. And in later videos, I would like to talk about the tools that we can use to assure that we're able to be proactive with our health, the things that make it a little easier for us. Until then, this is Paul at Keen Health signing off.